Started from the mud, now you see us going up Numbers never lie, now you see us blowing up People used to front, now you see them showing up So what's up, I've been down and now but look, look, look I'm trying to get where I'm going, but haters be trolling, that's where they f Thinking you got me right where you want me I tell a ghost just duck duck Sending them shots, we send them back Y'all yeah, ain't really about that Run, it's always bounce back Need more hands just to count that Stay on my bully, I need me more breeze Why you know I'm gang, gang, gang It's your girl and I am back for another video. Today we're doing a quick Dollar Tree slash Dollar General haul. I went and just, this was a random video, you guys. I was not really planning on doing like a haul video, but I was figured, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and spend money anyway on a whole lot of stuff that is not needed, but necessary. And <laughs> not necessary, but needed. You know what I'm saying? So I might as well show you guys what I got because I found some really cute stuff today. Just a little retail therapy. Like I said, I ain't need none of this stuff. The kids didn't, but we just got it anyway, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and go over and show you guys what I got. A lot of good stuff, a lot of good stuff. So let's go ahead and dive on into it. All right, you guys. So here is what we got. I kind of tried to section it off, but some of the stuff is mixed in. I'll tell you what it is and where it's from. Um, as I go. So here we go. Let's go ahead and get started. So right here we will start with this really cute um, throw that I got for the couch area because it is the same color like this light beige tannish with this black knit going through it. I thought it was really cute. This was $15. This was from Dollar General. this really cute little I don't know it's like a decor item <laughs> I don't know really what to call it but I got this from the uh, Dollar General as well and I thought it was just too cute and it says I think I love fall most of all because I really do y'all like and I don't know where I'm gonna put all of this fall stuff I just keep buying it because it's adorable I really do love fall y'all it is my favorite favorite season and I just I always go to I always do too much okay look listen just I'm gonna find a cute little place for it though um and then over here i got this cutting board and you know what i don't remember how much this was but i love the glass and i needed a glass cutting board for like my meats and stuff um because i have my big wooden one but i don't like to cut my meats up on it i have a lot of cutting boards i just collect them let's just call it that all right y'all um we'll stay on this side i got down here i got some edge control now all of this stuff is from dollar i mean yeah all this stuff is from dollar general except for these items which we'll get into in a minute so i got some kiss edge fixer maximum hold strawberry akai they have different flavors i've never tried this before but i was intrigued by the scents i should say not flavors but i was intrigued by the scent so i thought i'd check it out <music> I thought I'd try these these little iced coffees by International Delight. I've never tried them before. So I got the caramel macchiato and the Oreo, which I thought was interesting. So I got this little stand here. This was $6 at the Dollar General. I thought this was cute. I'm going to use this probably to stand up some sort of decoration, something like this. Maybe I don't know. Maybe not like that. One of my vases that I have turned upside down with some pumpkins in it. I, I, I'm working on that mentally. I don't know. That's not a part of this haul, but I don't know if I want to, I don't know what I'm going to do. But anyway, I got this little stand, so I'm going to use this with de for decoration. Every time I go to Dollar Tree, these are from Dollar Tree. 
And every time I go, I pick up hand sanitizer and disinfectant spray. Like you can never have too much. I spray down the kids' backpacks when they get out of school. Um, I spray down their lunch boxes before I wash them. Um, I keep one of these in my purse, one of these in my car. I have them on my counter in the, each bathroom. We use a lot of sanitizer and disinfectant sprays just because y'all, I mean, I don't even need to tell y'all, y'all already know why, what's going on, okay? And just cold and flu season is coming up in general. Just everybody getting sick, you know. Listen, just turn into complete germaphobes. We'll slide on over here to these little things for the kids. I like, every time I go out, anywhere I go, I have to buy the kids something. I don't care if it's a candy, I don't care if it's a little, I don't, I don't care. I have to get them something. So anyway, they don't need anything else. But I just have to get, I don't know, it's, 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 a, it's a mom disease. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just gonna say it, okay? So anyway, I saw these little cake pop lip gloss situations. I guess you're supposed to mix your own lip gloss. So I immediately thought of Cadence and Kaya, because even though Cadence is 13, this is still up her alley, okay? So definitely got a couple of those for Cadence and Kaya. The twins were just, were asking me for Barbie dolls. I literally just ordered them some off of Amazon. And then I see these, they come with two for $5. I mean, come on y'all, Dollar. this is from Dollar General, this stuff, you guys. So I had to get them, plus they're brown skin. So I love brown skin Barbies. So I got those for them. And then back here, I also got them a little pool. I just got one, cause I'm like, $10 for a pool, God. So anyway, I got them the little Barbie dolls and pools. So they already have lots of Barbie doll accessories and stuff. So I figured I'd have some good fun with that. Um, I got the boys some Beyblades. These were from Dollar General. I'm not really sure how much these were. And cause there's no price on them. I think they were eight bucks. Um, or it says eight plus here. So I'm just, <laughs> anyway. Um, so yeah, I don't know how much these were. I gotta check my receipt, but yeah, they weren't that expensive. And I got them these little Beyblades. All the boys are kind of into Beyblades. So I got these for one for Junebug, one for Blaze, and one for Kingston. Um, and then I got a little superhero car set for, um, for Onyx. <laughs> never tried any of their candles before so I'm not sure how they smell and how they burn but this is a true living which I believe that's a Dollar General scent um weathered oak and I liked the top on that it's like a faux wood top it's actually metal but um I just like the color of this it's giving me winter fall vibes and it smells like a real it's like a real clean masculine scent which I like those for candles I'm, I don't like doing all of this fruity all the time usually i do go for the fruity more savory scents but um this one is definitely more of like a men's cologne fragrance but not too heavy so i'm excited to burn that to see how that smells y'all know i'm a body wash addict so i went ahead and got some of the saint ives rose water and aloe vera i've never tried this before but it smells super good and it says 100 natural extracts it just caught my eye i like the packaging I'm also a sucker for packaging, y'all. So this was, I think, three bucks, and this candle, I believe, was five bucks. I don't see the price on here, but I believe this candle was five bucks. blending sponge from the Dollar Tree, which I, you know, every time I find a little cute little item like this makeup item, I buy it from the Dollar Tree. So I got that, can never have too many because I just threw away my other sponges. And these were so cute. I got these for the do from the Dollar Tree and I got a whole bunch of them for the girl's hair. And they're just like cute little barrettes, golden barrettes. I really loved these, the moon ones and this little what, triangular one. I just thought they were so pretty. Like, definitely can see myself using these in the girl's hair. So I just got a lot of them so I can stick them in my hair cart and we can use them whenever we do hair, which will be this weekend anyway. But I can pop them in before they go to school and it'd be really cute. <laughs> Before I forget, I got this from the Dollar Tree too. Now the Dollar Tree has this little spot that reminds me of Five Below and it's called, 
the plus section. So they have things in the Dollar Tree that in this one aisle are more than five or more than a dollar. And they have like a lot of, like I said, things that are like the five below or like 99 cent only. It really reminds me of 99 cent only. Um, and this was in that section. So I got this and I, you know what? I'm not sure how much this one costed, but since it didn't have a price, I'm gonna say it was probably less than $5, but I got it from that plus aisle. And I just thought it was really cute. Again, more decorative stuff that I don't know where the hell I'm gonna put, but I just had to have it. I'll find some corner window or bathroom to put it in, but it's really cute. Over here, I got some more stuff from the Dollar Tree, just some leaves, fall leaves. I think I can put those in some vases with some diamond scatter or with my pumpkins and it'll look really cute. I'm always buying dish soap. Um, now these I got from, the, all this is from the Dollar Tree as well. Now these I got from the Dollar Tree and they were like, they remind me of the trend that people are doing with their, like they'll put their fancy books, even though these are supposed to be hand cups for Halloween. Um, they remind me of those, big chains that people are doing like you know they're using them for decor like they're hanging it off of a book or something all that's all i saw when i saw this i didn't even know they were handcuffs i saw them at the dollar tree and i was like oh gotta get it because i picked it up from a spot it wasn't supposed to be in so i see it using it like this i might spray paint it gold or i might leave it like this hell i mean i don't know and it, it could be handcuffs but i'm using it for decoration i'm not using it for halloween but you see they're handcuffs so Right here, I got another clear vase because I want it to have um, another big, wide, open vase so I can put more pumpkins in like I did with that one. And so I got another vase here. Right now, I think I'm gonna put pumpkins in it, but you never know, okay? You never know what your girl. This was from the Dollar General, and how much did I pay for this? This was, oh, I don't even know, guys, sorry. I wanna say this was like five bucks. Flower. I just wanted to go with darker tones because again, I'm about to switch up my flowers that are back here. You see how, you guys see how those, I don't know if you guys can see them, but you see my flowers back here. They're like bright and more like summer. And I'm kind of going into like winter, fall. So I definitely wanted some darker toned um, flowers, but I usually don't buy them like this from these types of stores because look, they're $3 a well, but actually that wasn't there. It's starting to get dark, y'all, so I sw switched over to my ring light, so hopefully y'all can see this really good. So I got these really, really beautiful accent lights from the Dollar General, and um, I love them because they have the little fairy lights on the inside of them. They were really cute. They're the last two, so girl, I had to get them, okay? So I couldn't get two of the same like color, but I got them anyway. I don't care, I'm gonna use them somehow. So I got this little dark one and then this lighter gray one. They're so beautiful to me. I just love them so much. They need batteries and I know I didn't buy any. So I'm gonna have to either have Bay pick some up on the way home or I'll have to get some tomorrow. And I wait to put batteries in these and light them up. Oh my gosh, so pretty. a big candle pillar candle stand this was ten dollars so this is probably overpriced but i saw it it was black one of my favorite colors and i just was already excited about buying decor so i just went ahead and bought it i need a lamp for my office area there is plenty of lighting in there but it's just like yellow lighting and it just messes with my eyes y'all so i'm gonna put a daylight light bulb in here and i just thought it was really cute and elegant <laughs> guys we have a fragrance oil from the dollar tree i've never tried their fragrance oils before but i thought it was only dollar and why not it's probably if nothing else a light scent but i'll let y'all know how this smells and it is i got this in the harvest cider smell so hopefully i like it hopefully it smells really good um i got some elastic bands which we always can use for the girls a phone stand, which I need for my phone. I use my phone a lot for different things, so I can just pop it up next to my keyboard and yeah, I have that in my office. These I really needed, I've been meaning to get some more of these site, um, these site cards, these flash cards. 
for the boys and you know really mostly for the boys but i can go over these like the addition and subtraction i got these for the um for the girls for the twins too so i can help them um you know just memorize just so i can help them be faster at their addition and subtraction i probably should have got a multiplication too i don't think i saw one though but anyway i got an addition and subtraction same or different which i like rhyming and sight words for the boys so these were all each a dollar Okay, so I have a confession, you guys. I am addicted to notebooks. Every time I go out and I see a hardcover or even a cute notebook, and I'm a sucker for these hardcover ones, I buy it. If it's cute, a cute color, especially if it says something really cute or catchy, I fucking buy it. It's a problem and I need help, okay? I need I needed a, a shopping anonymous group, okay, in my area, virtual of course though, cause honey, I can't be in a lot of confined spaces with y'all, but I need a group. I need some therapy, okay? Cause this is, a, this, is, this is definitely, this is an addiction at this point. So anyway, this is such a good quality. I mean, it's thick, you guys. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to write in this. Obviously it says ridiculously good ideas cause I have a lot of those things. It was five bucks, but I really liked it. It's thick, it's got a lot of pages. Like I said, great quality. I can't wait to write in this and just write down all my good ideas, my ridiculously good ideas. All right, these are my favorite buys for the, for the night. This one I got from that plus section at Dollar Tree. So this was $5. So this is obviously a to-do list whiteboard and I've been meaning to do, I've been meaning to get one of these. Matter of fact, I was gonna take one of my whiteboards and make it into a to-do list, but then I saw this and I was like, I have to get it, okay? But then, so I went ahead and bought that at Dollar Tree and then I went to um, Dollar General and then I went and found this one, which is a, this is more of like a canvas dry erase type to-do list and it's huge it's like massive you guys do you see this za get from under my table now get from under there so it is a massive to-do um list this is things to do and things to buy which i'm like oh my gosh i really needed this so it was 15 dollars, but i really did not mind buying that spending that much because like i said i'm gonna definitely use this and this one even though it's smaller i'm still gonna use this but probably make this for a to-do list for all of the kids either their um appointments or an appointment to-do list or just chores something like that i don't know we're gonna figure it out but i'm definitely gonna use it but this one i was like yes baby for me i need this to stay organized and it's got the little boxes to check off baby yes <music> I can't really get to it right now from where I'm at. I'm holding my life. But but this this menu is the best thing I've seen in a really long time. Let me move this. So yeah, this menu is the best thing that I've, saw, I've seen in a really long time. It has all of the days of the week, even the weekends on it. It's got a grocery list, the week of, and notes. And it's huge, just as big as the other one. It's the same, a canvas. Um, a canvas dry erase they both came with a marker but i have plenty of dry erase markers um and i just like it because it's like it's more of like a picture so it's gonna go with the house stop so i can't wait to hang this up this also was 15 dollars, and let me tell y'all love it can't wait to use it this wasn't really a part of this haul but um, I'm gonna show you guys anyway because this is really cute. I haven't cleaned it. I just took it out the packaging. I gotta wash it out. But this is my little wine, little wine cauldron here, which I thought was super sexy. It comes with a little ball cork, which I thought was again sexy, fancy. Just pour it in like so. Without that, of course. Okay, you guys, so that is it for my little haul from uh, Dollar Tree and Dollar General. I got a lot of good stuff, I feel like. You know, I bought a lot of stuff that I'm gonna use. The kids, I know, look at them now. Look, there he goes. You ready to get your toy? Okay, y'all better be good, too. Wait, what? There you go. There's, there's Kai. Go ahead and grab. They've been waiting patiently, trying to anyway. 
Wait patiently. All right. No, go ahead and get them. What do you say? Thank you. You're welcome.